I'm Kathy Hopkins with Red Carpet Report, and we're here at the NBC Universal Summer Press Tour. So, uh, thank you for stopping by your Red Carpet Report. Uh, this is season two of I'm Kate, is that correct? Yes, oh my goodness, and you are just joining, aren't you? I'm joining. I joined the, the bandwagon, <laughs> the long road ahead. <laughs> She was a very good girl. She got a crash course in the sisterhood. Oh, really? That's How was that? Yeah. It was <laughs> good. I mean, the young people are so impressionable and so um, they're willing to absorb knowledge. Malleable. Yes. Like putty, really. Yeah. Looked out for her, though. Like, uh, you know, we were all, she had basically six older sisters. Five. Five? Jenny, Kate, Caitlin. Shandy, Candace, me. She had six older sisters looking out for her. I mean, her. you can't ask for better. I have zero older sisters, so I'm envious of that. <laughs> yeah. We were like in formation around Ella at any yeah. given moment. <laughs> That's why you go to a place with flying V. It's great. <laughs> totally, totally. So uh, what's the season like for you too, that, in addition to bringing on the new awesome faces? It, it's been incredible. Just so, de you know, for me, I watched season one from my home um, transitioning in high school and now it's like what we're doing with season two is a little bit different now we're taking it onto the road we're leaving California and really trying to headbutt um, some visibility into other places states around the nation you know that don't really always have visibility and like you know yesterday was the trans day of visibility which is kind of where we we celebrate being visible and being ourselves openly. Um, and that's what it's all about. It's, you know, it's about really letting the world see and watch um, the differences and the, the way, the, all the different ways of being yourself and being trans. There's not one way. Um, and um, that was really important. And I think that's what we did. It was really good. Do you feel like uh, you also got any more uh, insight going on the road, going to the different uh, cities and such? You know, the, there, there's no like common denominator really in the trans community. It's such an incredibly diverse community. We come from all backgrounds, all kinds of histories, religions. The thing that unifies us is a feeling that we have inside. Yeah. And it's so rare that we have the opportunity to just connect with each other and to get a better understanding of the community that we're a part of. So it was a real privilege to be on this show and to be able to kind of put a positive face on a civil rights movement. Fantastic. I'm really glad you guys got to go out there and just, you know, spread, you know, information and knowledge with everybody and connect with people. It's fantastic. Thank you. Can't wait to see the new season of MK. Thanks for yes. watching. <laughs> Thanks for watching. If you like this, please give us a thumbs up, subscribe for more interviews, and let us know in the comments below what you're watching this summer.